Okay, so logging into the Pierce eCampus is equivalent to walking through the front door of the physical campus. It means that you're on campus, but you're not technically in class yet. So once you've logged in, you'll land on the eCampus dashboard. The dashboard gives you a glimpse into the happenings in all of your classes. And from the eCampus dashboard, you'll have access to three different types of content. The global navigation up top, which is this section here, the sidebar feed on the right side of the page, which is this section here, and the eCampus stream that takes up the middle of the page. The term global navigation means that no matter what class or page you're in, you will always have access to your calendar, which populates due dates for assignments and other eCampus events. You'll have access to your grades, your assignment feed, and the course selection drop-down menu. And located at the top right corner of the global navigation are links to your inbox, your profile settings, logout, and help desk. The sidebar feed helps you prioritize what you should do next. And the eCampus stream keeps you up to date on recent activities within the eCampus in your current class. So to finally get around to answering the question, you would get into your class by mousing over the course selection drop down menu and selecting or clicking on the particular class that you're interested in getting into. Once you're in the class, you'll move in and out of different areas by using the left navigation section located on the left of the page. Again, do not expect that every class will look or function the same. You may see different combinations of buttons on the left navigation panel according to how and what your professor wants you to have access to. That said, most faculty will package the class content and curriculum into a module. So a safe place to start in your class is by accessing the modules button from the navigation panel. 